The most tremendous minds, the most tremendous contributions comes from those, from those that are outside of the box. I don't even need to give examples of that to make that known. So, back to my point, when it comes to social theory, if you will, credentialism, I give zero weight to. Academia is a detriment to advancing social progress. Another form of attack simply comes from the cultural nuance, comes from the social programming, uh, what we call the self-appointed guardians of the status quo. People that are suffering in the system just like anyone else, but their social identification is so powerful, they are so locked into the box, that they find it infuriating to think that what they're living is actually wrong, paradoxically. I get this all the time from people. The self-appointed guardians of the status quo are birthed in religion, birthed in economics, birthed in the illusion of democracy that we see today across the world, birthed in the, the various isms that are entirely pointless, capitalism, communism, fascism, socialism. You have the priesthood of the monetary system, the capitalists, if you will, you can give it that rhetoric. I don't use that word. It's meaningless. The monetarism is the word I use. The pretense for acquisition of money is based on differential advantage, which is based on dishonesty, period. Then you have the priesthood of religious concepts, religious identification, and the idea that somehow we know everything already, and there's a God, he's looking down on us, controlling everything. I won't even go into the paradoxes that come from that extremely narrow notion. So in other words, the biggest crutch to the evolution of human thought is breaking your own indoctrination. It's very, very difficult to overcome emotional elements that have become so ingrained in you that you have an immediate reaction, an immediate suffering and pain when anything interferes with that. And it's a very, very complex problem. But I'll say it again. We have to learn how to break, excuse me, we have to learn how to identify and break our own indoctrination if we expect to move forward at all as a civilization.